Hello YouTubers, welcome to the Titan Extreme YouTube channel. In today's presentation, I bring my frying, backpacking frying pan lid. This is originally the lid of a soda crackers Kibler brand can that I got at Walmart, Food Lion. Any you mention any um Grocery store out there, they probably have it. Comes in two colors, blue or green, doesn't matter. You can buy either color. They weigh the same, they say it's the same size. They happen to be the same diameter of this frying pan. This is the Eddie Bauer, I think that's the brand, Eddie Bauer brand mess kit. Let me show you how this how this comes originally. It comes with this other frying pan, let me put it together. See, this is it. It comes with two frying pans. Why two frying pans? Why can you fry in two frying pans that you cannot fry in one frying pan? Well, I don't know. That's the way it comes. Maybe both together can be used as an oven. I've seen people out there, you know, baking with this, muffins, pizza, stuff like that. Um, it comes with a handle, cup, bowl. I don't bring all that when, when I'm backpacking. And just because... I eat right out of the frying pan. When I go with my wife and kids and we're cooking for, for the four of us, well, I'll, I'll serve them what, what they're going to eat and I come right out of the pan. It's, you know, that way I don't have to bring another item like the bowl or the plate, if that's the case. Unless I'm going to you know, cook something real gourmet that requires a lot like French toast. You have the bread, you need the bowl. For the for the beaters, the eggs and milk, and you know the mix, and then where you're frying them, you take them out and put them in in some place. Unless you know you're backpacking in a very cold winter. If I've not made French toast in the winter like that, but I imagine if I do that, I will try to you know to make maybe two there and eat it right out of the pan. Immediately, I don't know. I guess I wouldn't make French toast in the winter when I think about it. Anyway, I have brought my frying pan just for the purpose of cooking something real gourmet that is like restaurant quality food, like some Mexican dish. I have had fried beans cooked in there, plant, fried plantains, fish, some occasions, omelet eggs. Man, there's nothing better than being out there in a rustic of the forest without any comfort unless other than the one that you bring and eat a meal a great meal that is like restaurant quality meal something that you order in a restaurant right there while everybody is eating maybe trail mix uh, granola bars things like that I bring that too for snacks or for a second meal in the winter like second lunch but uh, other than that, I, you know, I, I bring my frying pan for, for the purpose I just explained. It's good to have this. The lid also uh, provides, well, I guess I already mentioned it, right? The time saving, the fuel saving, the comfort. It's the comfort of having that. I guess I'm going to be drilling a little hole somewhere just to let steam it out of there, steam the heat out of there. Um, so the one, otherwise it's gonna be like floating around. I don't know. Maybe I, I won't. Maybe I will. I don't know what I'm gonna do. But you know, I will test it first, and then later I will decide uh, what to do about reading a hole there. Yes, this represents another item to bring. But you know, like I just mentioned, I replaced the rest for this only one item, which is a lot lighter than the original that came with it, which is the other frying pan. I mean that other frying pan is a lot heavier. This is a lot heavier than that lid, that I DIY lid made out of tin can. And uh, I don't know if I mentioned it earlier but my backpacking used to be a lot heavier. Not anymore. I tried to find a lid commercially sold out there. I couldn't find it. Uh, whatever you find out there in a in a 
uh, pot section at Walmart or wherever you go to do your, do your shopping, you find some that is either too heavy or too big or too small or too something. This is just perfect. This just happened to be the same diameter. You see, this frying pan has a lip here around where this sits very nicely. It's like it almost like it was tailor-made for it. It's a coincidence. Well, that's what I do. I when it comes to lids, this is the second lid that I made for one of my utensils or pots, pans. The other one that I did was for my pot cup. I'm referring to another video that I did about that. You just go ahead and find it and, and watch it. I made it out of the lid of a I guess it's a quarter of a gallon uh, paint uh, or half a gallon. I don't remember exactly what it is, but you know, watch that video and you will see. Um, so this is the solution. If you happen to have this mess kit, but you don't have to look around, and you have not considered that. I mean, I've I've seen people that bring I like I used to do bring the entire cooking set and then just use the frying pan, and the rest you just carry it. Say, oh, here is my 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 cook set uh, to, to keep it all together I just keep it at home it's gonna provide only more for you to make more effort into carrying things you know when you go backpacking out there chances are that you're gonna be climbing up a mountain you're going up the hill so the lighter your backpack is the better um, that's what I've learned and I will show you other videos in which I made you know came up with other ideas how to make my backpacking experience a lot more pleasant by making my backpack lighter. Um, I know my, I did it for my wife and she's enjoying it a lot. And she doesn't go with me every time. But uh, like 50% of the time she comes with me and she's enjoying her very under 15 pounds, maybe, maybe around the 10 pounds backpack. Um, I carry, when, when she comes along, I carry the tent in which we both are going to sleep, so that helps her a lot. Uh, I don't know what else to say about this presentation. I hope you like, you enjoyed it, you like it, you take it into consideration. And like I always say, until my next video, later.